Hello everyone, and I welcome all of you to online study for you a complete placement solution. So, friends, today we have a special guest with us. His name is Avnish, and he has got selected in uh, TCS Digital and many other companies like Wipro. Uh, so today he is here, and he will share his experience, like how did he got into TCS Digital through TCS NQT, and uh, even uh, he had missed his interview. So how did the interview got scheduled? So each and everything definitely he is going to talk in detail. So before we proceed further, I wanted to congratulate Avnish for getting selected in TCS Digital. Thank you. And Thank you uh, I much. also wanted to say to the audience that TCS Digital package is uh, seven LPA. Okay. So Avnish, uh, now the floor is completely yours. So please introduce yourself, and then uh, you can tell like how exactly uh, things happened. Like how did you clear NQT and how you got a a uh, chance for uh, tcs digital so each and everything definitely we wanted to know from you uh, thank you very much sir for inviting me on your platform i hope uh, this interview experience will help many one uh, to achieve their achievement so my name is onish kumar singh i am pursuing my btech uh, from greater noida institute of technology i have cleared uh, recently tcs digital and i have also got an offer from wipro so mm -hmm. that's all from my end okay great so can you start like how it happened how did you apply for tcs it was paid or free and qt and uh, when did you write the test and how everything happened so we wanted to hear from you okay so i am starting from the registration process uh, after the end of the third year i got a mail from uh, my placement uh, my placement said uh, tnp which is uh, conducted each and every uh, you know each and every after 6 months we have to register on the tcs nqt or next step portal mm -hmm. so i got a mail from my tnp and i have registered on it uh, after the end of the third year so uh, in september uh, 2021 mm -hmm. i got a mail from uh, tcs uh, next step portal that uh, ninja drive is open for all so i have to just log in onto my tcs next step portal and i have to just apply for the drive mm -hmm. so after applying for the drive after half a month we can say uh, i got again a mail that my nqt is scheduled on this day right uh, i can say in the uh, first week of the uh, october Mm -hmm. i got a mail and my uh, nqt is scheduled up around uh, 10th of october right okay so after <clears throat> in the nqt uh, we all know that there are multiple uh, verbal english questions aptitude questions and there are two coding questions as well mm -hmm. so after clearing uh, the nqt mm -hmm. uh, after uh, we can say 20 or 25 days i got a mail uh, mm -hmm. that i have been selected for tcs stoppers and i have to clear the tcs stoppers uh, ninja test right mm -hmm. so again uh, there is a test uh, which is conducted for all the tcs digital candidate mm -hmm. and i was luckily one of them uh, so it was a one hour test right uh, there are two coding questions mm -hmm. and the coding questions we can say uh, that they are uh, not uh, the difficulty is not much very much high right mm -hmm. the difficulty is on medium level so do you remember uh, what was the coding question asked to you in the ninja topper test Yes, yes, I, I can very well remember uh, because the very first question is uh, of the array question, which mm -hmm. I have to, you know, uh, there are multiple array elements mm -hmm. that I have to sort, and uh, there are some modifications that I have to do on the array element. So it was very easy uh, because I have done it uh, various times this type of questions. So the first question is very easy for me, and I did it within fifteen uh, minutes. Mm -hmm. So there are forty-five minutes for the second question, but mm -hmm. the second question was. Uh, unluckily uh, of the data structure question right mm -hmm. so i have to use hash map mm -hmm. and after using different uh, data structure i could not uh, you know pass all the uh, uh, you know test cases that the tcs provides mm -hmm. but uh, after using the hash map mm -hmm. the exact question i cannot remember the second question i cannot remember the exactly mm -hmm. but i can very well remember that after using the hash map it resolves and all the test cases passes so okay. luckily i solved uh, both the questions okay great great okay then when when you were called for the interview okay so after uh, clearing the second round mm -hmm. uh, i guess uh, 20th of october after 5 or 6 days i got a mail mm -hmm. uh, but i did not you know uh, i did not check the mail re on regular basis mm -hmm. so i missed checking it because uh, tcs you know uh, notify you one or two day before uh, the interview they did not give you 10 or 20 days no. uh, that your interview is after 20 days no mm -hmm. uh, they give you just two or three days right mm -hmm. correct so i got a mail on 25th of october that your interview is uh, on 27th of october mm -hmm. but in these three days mm -hmm. i uh, did not check my mail so this is very surprising for me because i uh, regularly check my mails but uh, i think there are some saturdays and sundays on that period so mm -hmm. i did not uh, check my mail 
and one of the reason is my birthday is on 25th of october so there must be a reason that i did not check the mail because i was busy in celebrating my birthday mm-hmm. but uh, when you uh, miss this type of mail then you forgot the all the celebrations of your birthdays right mm-hmm. so uh, I I get I got a call from the HR of PCS uh, mm-hmm. on 28th of October that you missed your interview your digital interview mm-hmm. and I was really shocked at that time uh, I was working in a internship uh, in a company in uh, Rajendra Place Delhi mm-hmm. and uh, in after afternoon we can say one o'clock I got a call that you have missed your digital TCS digital interview mm-hmm. so I was uh, like uh, I, I missed a very you know the aim company. the aim company that you have aimed on entering the you know uh, btech that i have to clear the tcs digital and you miss the interview mm. so we can think that what is the you know condition of mine at that time so i was like uh, there uh, could nothing that could make me you know into the tcs digital mm-hmm. in the next six months because there must be a gap of six months mm-hmm. uh, between uh, between the two interviews right mm-hmm. yes yes so i was i was a searching for on youtube on quora mm-hmm. on different platforms on linkedin i am approaching for the different you know artists digital candidates that mm-hmm. will they schedule the interview or will they mm-hmm. uh, reschedule the interview uh, but the answer is there must be a very little chance or negligible chances mm, yes, then sir. i was like i was like uh, oh god i missed a very you know important chance mm-hmm. but uh, uh, at last i made a small try i mailed to a tcs career team i mailed to the hr mm-hmm. uh, that this is my condition and i missed the interview and this was the reason mm-hmm. so uh, i think i am very lucky at that period of time and i got a mail after uh, 10 days that mm-hmm. uh, your interview is rescheduled and mm-hmm. you have to uh, your interview is tomorrow mm-hmm. so uh, uh, you know after seeing that mail mm-hmm. i have got only one one night for preparing for the interview right Mm-hmm. so uh, for that one night uh, i you know uh, never want to sleep and sleeping is not very important for me at that period of time mm-hmm. i uh, started looking for many interview experiences on gigs for gigs on youtube and your uh, youtube platform is one of them i got uh, you know uh, 10 to 15 interview experiences of ninjas and uh, digital what tcs ask everything i you know uh, searching searching and searching for whole night mm-hmm. and at 10 o'clock in the next morning i s- sat for the interview mm-hmm. uh, and the interview gone very well technical interview i cleared very well mm-hmm. and the hr interview is tend to so what are questions uh, were asked in the technical uh, and the hr interviews okay so uh, let me first clear the technical interview that what are the questions asked in technical interview mm-hmm. the very first question was uh, tell me about yourself which is very common uh, mm-hmm. so uh, i i must uh, suggest for each and every candidates who are trying to you know get into the tcs or many big companies like tcs Mm-hmm. that you have to answer this question very honestly mm-hmm. you did not copy the uh, this answer from any uh, you know youtube lecture or any uh, source of internet that tell me something about yourself and this is the answer and i have to copy paste it each and everywhere so this is a very bad manner and mm-hmm. the interviewee which is taking the interview uh, clearly knows that this uh, person is you know uh, recollecting the things he is not answering it honestly so you have to answering it honestly that what are your achievements what do you have done what are the projects you have did what are the internships you have did everything in detail and honestly because when they you know uh, finds internships and projects in your introduction then they feel very easy and they did not ask you different questions they began asking you the questions from your internships from your projects mm-hmm. and that's it so tell me something what your self answer is must be very honest there must not be any type of you know changes that you have to copy paste from the google or some somewhere else so okay. this must be very easy and honest so uh, i answered my tell me about yourself questions very honestly i answered my academics i answered my i am also second district topper in 12 so i mentioned it mm-hmm. and they were like uh, they were like very impressed mm-hmm. and after that i mentioned my projects which i did in java mm-hmm. after that i mentioned my internships which i am doing and what projects i am working on in the internship so i mentioned each and everything in detail and honestly so their second question was uh, from the internships and i guess 10 to 15 questions they asked me from the internships and the projects and i answered it very honestly and very clearly because i have worked on them there is nothing uh, which is you know wrong or which which has to be copied paste from the google i answered it very honestly mm-hmm. so they were like you were uh, you cleared 
means they did not tell me that i have cleared the technical round but their body language uh, you know after uh, seeing their body language i can very well understand that i have cleared the technical round okay. so uh, i got a link uh, from their side that you have to uh, click on that link and join the hr round in the very next minute Mm-hmm. so i joined the hr round and the hr round uh, went 10 to 15 minutes mm-hmm. uh, i have to answer the some common questions that each and every hr asks like where do you want to see you about uh, yourself in the fi- next 5 years mm-hmm. tell me something about yourself do you want to relocate do you find any difficulties in relocating etc etc mm-hmm. so i answered them very honestly honesty and integrity i i must say are the two things which must be included in your each and every answer Mm-hmm. honesty and integrity if you maintain your honesty and integrity in each and every answer then there must be no chance of you know rejecting you because tcs is a company which uh, works more on ethics and values so okay. your ethics and values are the most important things that they want to see in during the interview so that is the whole process that went and after around one month they took around one month to generate my offer letter and between between one month this is the very crucial time for me because there are uh, two portions of mind that divides like one is uh, they may send the offer letter and the another one say no they, they they may not send the offer letter so there are two things which come in my mind each and every day i cannot sleep very well so after uh, around one month 8th of december mm-hmm. uh, at 3 o'clock i got a mail from tc hotel <laughs> that you interview went very well and we are moving forward with you and your offer letter uh, can be downloaded from next portal and and i was like i never i i did not go to sleep at that night also i'm celebrating celebrating and celebrating and the next day i i was like yeah so that's the whole process and my experience okay so uh, you joined the tcs digital or uh, uh, i mean when is your joining date or you already joined uh i have accepted the offer letter and my ilp has been already started so after clearing the ilp and pra ip ipa uh, examinations have already been started i have given one of the ipa of 14th of january in nevada but the second ipa which is going to be on 30th of january uh, it will be online uh, camera proctored and the next two or three ipa i think they uh, uh, provide the camera proctored because due to the covid cases and all okay, so okay. Uh, must be joining letter maybe in the july or after july okay or i have to mm-hmm. and what is your pass out year a pass out year is 2022 uh, in the mid of july or uh, okay near about that okay then your joining will be at that time okay so in technical they asked you uh, mostly the questions from the internship only no question from the coding language right no they did not ask me uh, from the coding language because I, i have mentioned the five or six projects in java right Okay. and two internships i have did two internships uh, till that period of time mm-hmm. so these two internships and five or six projects of java uh, mm-hmm. are the you know enough i think enough for them to you know select okay so great so uh, thank you anish uh, for coming to our platform and uh, sharing your uh, journey so uh, this is really a very good journey and uh, the missing the interview part was like a uh, concern for many of the student um, so i always ask yes, them yes. to you know to follow follow up with either uh, tcs or infosys you continuously send them a mail that uh, we interviewer interview was missed uh, either uh, because of technical issues or uh, because of some reasons or interview did not join so they will definitely uh, get back to us but uh, you have to follow up with them uh, otherwise uh, see you need a job not the company uh, because company has already so many candidates so if you need yes, yes, a yes. job then you have to go behind or or you have to continuously mm. follow up with them because the candidate is the first person we who have to who has to request him mm, uh, yes. because they did not come to you you have to come to them correct, because correct. Uh, the candidate needs a job yes yes, yes. So you are right right yeah. so uh, thank you anish uh, uh, and definitely if there will be any comment in the comment section i would like you to reply it uh, reply to them uh, so that they will get Okay. Uh, I will continuously it. check your comments. Yes, yes. Yeah. If you have missed something, uh, capturing in the interview, then. Okay. okay. Yeah. You. All the best. Take care.